For me, it's all been about routine. 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 I decided to make some time for myself in the morning to either go for my daily run or exercise as many days as possible, especially as I'm not commuting anymore. I'm making sure that I, I get up at the same time, I start work at the same time, and take breaks at the same time. I try to avoid sitting in my workspace for a long period of time. Get up, have a little break, have a cup of tea, sit in the garden, just a few minutes to break up the day. Allowed me to prepare for conversations with clients and also to actually conduct conversations in a much more personal and private setting. This is really important when we're dealing with clients who are discussing disabilities, medical records, finances. And when it's time to end my working day, I log off and step away completely from my desk. I am able to use that time to spend quality time with my family, which has been an absolute godsend. Every single afternoon, I have been able to spend time with my two young children. A little bit of schooling, but a lot of fun. To get more done around my home without it piling up for the weekend. Being able to catch up with friends and family and being able to cook more. Do some gym work, go for a run, keep well and have that done by say seven o'clock at night compared to what would normally be nine o'clock if I was traveling in and out of London. With that time, I've been reading and spending some time on our balcony in the sunshine. My communication with lots of friends and family has increased. So lots of people that I would only maybe touch base with Fortnightly, I would be speaking to weekly, which is nice. I can concentrate on more of our clients' cases and it will give me extra time in the evenings to concentrate on my studies. That's the S&G way.